The essence of the message of the Quran is conveying to human beings who is their Lord. So that they would understand that worship belongs to Him alone. That He is the only one who deserves to be worshipped. Without any intermediaries between Himself and His creatures. That all of the various forms of intermediacy, they're all false. They're not from God. God did not teach this. God taught that we worship Him alone. Ud'uni astajib lakum. Call on me, God says in the Quran. Allah says, call on me and I will answer your prayers. So no matter how much people might logically try to explain the need for intercessors, how do they explain it? Commonly they will say, listen, you dirty with sins. You're not a perfect human being. You've committed many sins. So you're dirty with sins. And you want to approach God who is pure. Then you need to find somebody who is closer to Him due to His or her purity. And then you pray through them. You call on them in prayer. And because they're closer to God, they will get your prayers up to God. Just like in this world, what happens? You want to see the Prime Minister? You can't just go down to the uh, home of the Prime Minister and knock on his door and say, Mr. Prime Minister, I'd like to have a little chat with you. No, it doesn't work like that. You have to see your local representative who then speaks to somebody else and this one speaks to that one, up the ladder, till finally it gets to the Prime Minister. It's the same way. Sounds logical. But that is not understanding God. That is logic of this world, of this life. That's how we do things. But... God has made it clear that He hears all. He knows all. So we don't need intermediaries between ourselves and God. To add intermediaries, to use intermediaries, whether we call them saints, and we have Muslims who believe in saints, as Catholics do, or we call them imams, and they're Muslims who believe that there are individuals, 12 in number, who have the attributes of Allah. And they are intermediaries to whom you may pray, call on, seek guidance. They will do things for you in this life because you call on them. Any of such beliefs are false. They are a result of not knowing our Lord.